Hey guys, Sock here from Socky Ticket. In today's video, we have a brand new update for the Samsung Galaxy Note 20 Ultra. We actually have two important updates I want to talk about. The first one is the usual update. If you tap on settings on the top, it's going to say a software update is available. And if you go all the way down, it's right over here. You tap on download and install, and it looks like we have the brand new September the 1st security patch and a few other under the hood improvements that makes the phone better. We're gonna install that, let me download this. While that downloads, the second update actually is more important. Now this one is known as the Samsung Core Services Update. Now to get that update, what you wanna do is you wanna click the link down below that's gonna take you to my website. Once you're at the website, you wanna scroll down just a little bit and you wanna click the link under download right here. So when you click this, it'll take you to the Galaxy Store to Samsung Core Services. You want to make sure you click this update. In many ways, this is one of the most important updates for any Samsung phone. Now, in this case, what's happening is it's improving the phone's search performance and functionality. So when you're in your finder and you're searching for something, it's going to improve that, make it faster, more precise, and a few other enhancements. Uh, but basically, in case you're wondering what this update is and why you should always keep an eye out for this, is if you scroll down and you look at the description, the core services updates are designed to make your phone better without the traditional software updates. So if you look over here, it says it's used in various Samsung applications such as the camera, gallery, messages, contacts, settings, and finder. Boom, you update this, your phone's gonna get better. So always keep an eye out for this update. I just got this a couple days ago. It's been around for a couple days now. So make sure you have it. Now let's uh, go over here, do the patch update, and I'll be right back once it's done. We'll see exactly what's new with that as well. All right, so the software update is now complete. I'm gonna tap on OK. And like I said, with this update, uh, we have gotten the brand new September the security patch, which is great. Again, go to your about phone. Go to software information. At the bottom, it's going to tell you the security patch level. You can click it. It's going to take you to the website, Android's website, and then you can click on Samsung to get details on exactly what has been squashed in this uh, update as far as security was concerned. Now, beyond that, if you look at this update, as I've said, we don't have any new features specifically. But if you go inside, we have some under the hood improvements as usual. Enhanced features, improvements to performance, your phone will be feeling faster. Not every time the upgrade is discernible, but there's always an improvement under the hood and your phone gets better. But the highlight of this update is the security patch, which is also very important. You wanna make sure you have security. And of course, make sure to get that Samsung Core update, okay? That's actually more important than this update as far as making your phone even better. All right, so if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, drop them down below. Let me know. For now, guys, have a fantastic day, all right? All right, so if you found this video useful, make sure to subscribe to Saki Tech by clicking that button, and also click that bell icon on the side to make sure you get notified every time I upload a new video. And if you do use Twitter, Instagram, or Facebook, you can follow me at Saki Tech Online to get the latest updates as well. All right, have a fantastic day.